Hello everyone, Metal Digital's here. Today I'll be playing Poppy Playtime, Chapter 3. Deep Sleep. In the aftermath of the train crash, you now find yourself stranded in the depths of the new world in your sights. What's the time? Playtime! Critters. The wind's really scary. I can't sleep. Hey, we'll be okay, guys. I promise. All winds blow away. Eventually. Hello? Who's this? Catnap! Please, help us go to sleep, Catnap! We need it, Catnap! Please help us! Sleep! 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 <laughs> what the hell was happening? Did you just kill them all? Good God. Everyone it? knows Huggy Wuggy and Poppy Playtime, but are your children safe from Playtime Co.'s latest toy? What you've seen here is Playtime Co.'s own Smiling Critters, a limited series cartoon meant to celebrate the release of the toys sharing its name. Yet both now face the fire sparked by the inclusion of one key member. This is Catnap. And like the others of his line, you just pull his little tail and... seems innocent enough. However, parents across the country report their children experiencing strange and often violent nightmares. And beside them, their little grinning catnap doll. Now, with controversy growing, Playtime Co. has announced the recall of all catnap toys from the Smiling Critters line. His image cleared from all promotional material. But damage already done, will disappearing be that easy? The exact cause of these incidents still unknown, only one thing appears glaringly certain. Your children are not safe with catnap. Playtime Chapter 3. Supposed to be cat now. Oh, God, Did you just throw me down the tube. Right, you put me in a trash compactor. Right, get out of here. Run.
puzzle. Harper debrief. All right, Miss Harper. Please explain the situation. Spare no detail. Well, like any night, all the children were getting asleep. It was peaceful, quiet. Catnap had the red smoke in the room. Then suddenly, there was this scream. Nightmares happen, I know, but this... I mean, dilated pupils and quivering lips. The way her eyes darted around the room, and I swear, her hand and mine, it felt like her blood was boiling beneath her skin. She saw something, too. Something horrible. She... I, I, I'm sorry. I don't mean to. Miss Harper, we'll provide the very best care we can offer. You have my word. But this is important. Did Marie happen to describe what she saw? Yes, a monster, she said, said that it was colorless. Gosh, I could feel the poor little heart pounding. For her, it was right there. And her movements, they were so wild. Arms flailing, legs kicking. Hmm. I, I wanted to talk to her, see how she's doing. I, I just, I really need to hear her voice right now. That would not be advised, Miss Harper. There are many concerns we must address at this time. But vital, show normal, and we'll continue to monitor. She'll be okay. No! Well, pardon me if I'm not comforted by that. <laughs> Just bring my little girl back to me. <laughs> what were they doing here? Bloody handprint on the couch. Oh, this is where he threw me down the, uh, to the trash compactor. Radio. Place a battery. Remember you? Really? An elephant always remembers. Want to know what I remember about you? What? <laughs> okay. That was a little spooky. I'm Bubba Bubbafint. Hey, I remember you. Hello? 
Oh, he answered that. Phone call? Did that. We need you. You are our mission. Together, we can save a lot of people, including you. Lake here is straight ahead. It's the home of Catnap, one of the smiling critters. There used to be eight of them, I think. Now it's just him. Lake here is his church, his hunting ground. Whatever he wants it to be. You better get moving quickly. We'll keep in touch. Oh, and by the way, my name is Ollie. Nice to meet you. Okay, Ollie. statue. Playtime Lemonade. See you again soon. Please wait for a counselor to meet you before proceeding. station. Take the beam with Q E. Okay. Now what?
Okay. Did that. What does this do? Are you serious? Chicken! Wanna go outside and hang out? It's looking pretty bad outside! I've never been outside before. Will you come with me? I'm scared. Here, follow me. I'll step out first. Well, I guess he's dead. See the world through the eyes of a child on Elliot's Express. Treat yourself at Playtime's new park. An hour of joy.
Telepheric. Is it a cable car? to my soul than being the reason for a child's smile, to be the spark that ignites all their hopes and dreams, for it is only through hopes and dreams that we may create a better world, one where our children need not be afraid, one where they are protected. And after all, this company and its toys are nothing without them. These children deserve to smile. They deserve to love. And they deserve a safe home. That is why it is with enormous pleasure that as the founder of Playtime Co., I announce... Playcare! Our very own on-site orphanage. But it's not only that. It's a school, a playhouse, a place to belong our very own ecosystem beneath the surface, dedicated in every inch and detail to ensuring a child's smile. It's teachers and counselors, mothers and fathers, until such a time they have all of that in you. May play care bring joy, inspiration, and smiles to all who enter these doors. For what gives life its meaning if not a smile? Right? The kids used to live here. Now look at it. Anyways, do you see that statue in the middle of the room? Take the stairs that go under it. There's a really cool room in there that powers literally all of play care. I can give you a key down there. Okay. Happy hopscotch. Unafraid to hop where others might sit, Hoppy is a friend everyone needs to maintain their energy and enthusiasm. While sometimes loud or impatient, she'll always hop beside her friends, even if it means slowing up once in a while to keep their pace. Press me. I'm Hoppy Hopscotch. Wanna try hopping to the moon with me? I'm Hoppy Hopscotch. Wanna try hopping to the moon with me? No. I'm Hoppy Hopscotch. Wanna try hopping to the moon with me? Picky Piggy. What's more important than play and learning? Picky Piggy knows the answer. A playful body and a keen mind are fueled by what's put into them, which is why she encourages her friends to eat a well-balanced diet. Secretly, PB&Js are her favorite food. Hi there! I'm Picky Piggy. Let's eat! Hi there! I'm Picky Piggy. Let's eat! Dog Day. This is Dog Day, the sunny, strong, and determined leader of our Dog players. Dog Day says, fetch! Each trusts him to find the bright side in any situation. And to have a friendly word of encouragement should they feel down. He'll always keep his friends going, no matter what. Dog Day says, fetch! Bobby Bear Hug. A kind, caring soul, Bobby Bear Hug shows compassion for everyone and for everything. People and places and things, large or small, are all receivers of her love. Each is enriched by this attention and affection, and in turn, so is she. Hi, I'm 
and Bobby Bear Hug. Wanna know how much I love you? Kickin' Chicken. This is Kickin' Chicken, the cool kid of the crew. And he maintains that sense of cool through anything. Even the most tense of situations. Knock him down, and he'll pick himself up. Brush himself off and ask, what's next? Hey! I'm Kickin' Chicken! Wanna go outside and hang out? Bubba Bubba Fant. Bubba Bubba Fant is the brains of the critters, bright and attentive. He keeps his friends straight. He keeps his friends steady and always steers them to make smart choices. That way, you all might grow up to be bright and brilliant, each in their own right. I'm Bubba Bubba Fant. Hey, I remember you. Crafty Corn, a conscious observer of both color and creativity in the world. Crafty Corn understands the importance of art and sharing it with others. Crayons, pencils, paint, or words on the page. Unicorn can Just be don't and understand you. Imagine given shape. Hi, I'm Crafty Corn. Can you help me with my painting? Pass me the blue, please. Shut up, Ollie. I'm busy. This looks like that tube from the movie uh, Jigsaw. I need to get shot with a shotgun. Nope. So you got the key. Now the question you're probably asking yourself is, where does it go? Well, yes. head back out, and you should find a door just to the left of the cable car you took down here. Watch your step. Always remain aware of your surroundings. Falls can be lethal. Don't forget your mask. Employees always wear a gas mask whenever the red smoke is present. Welcome to the gas production zone. The beating heart of the whole evil play care system. All that gas you see coming from the machine is made right here in the factory. It's called the Red Smoke. Right now, it's all headed off to the right. We need to make that Red Smoke go left instead. That's how we can get to him. The machine will probably have a few dumb safeguards for you to work around, but I think you can do it. I'll call you once it's done. Warning, all personnel must ensure the secured entrance closes behind them. Failure to comply will result in reassignment from Class 3 status. What are they doing down here? Right, a battery.
What is this thing? It's a big hatch. Do not enter. batteries in here. I guess. More blood. Okay. you all right so how do we get up there figured out.
Okay, got that one. Finally. What's going on? Oh no! Someone killed the power! Okay, I sent you another key. It's under the statue. Use it to get into home sweet home. Then once you're inside, find the building's backup generator. Good luck! 
quit. Care. Home sweet home, toy store, counselor's office, entrance, playhouse, school. sweet home. So this way. Oh cool. Cool giant ducks. Yeah, we just keep jumping in and drive one of those things. be it. Seems to be the only place with lights on.
I guess. What's happening? Grab pack is gone. What's happening? Did I get captured again? Happy and fun, why was it done? news this morning as of 9.45 a.m. Local authorities report that the body of a young boy has been found on the estate of the late Elliot Ludwig, an esteemed toy maker and originator of the Playtime Company. At this time, an identity for the child awaits official confirmation. Found in an upstairs bedroom in a large duffel bag, officers on scene report that the remains appear to have been disturbed. Organs, as well as key bones from the skeletal structure, were reported missing from the body. It is unknown at this time whether this extraction was, in fact, the cause of death. Wow, he was killing kids. And harvesting the organs and stuff. Tragic news this morning, as of 9.45 a.m., local authorities report that... Claw marks. Following recent events, Playtime Co. was asked for any comment regarding the discovery. This is what they had to say. Quote, It's sickening. Elliot Ludwig was a great man, and those who knew him understood that he was not capable of violence, let alone what others now claim. He had a deep love in his heart for children like this one, making the actions of whoever planted this body all the more sick. Sure he did. We look forward to clearing his good name both in the public eye and in the eyes of the law. Stay tuned for more. A clap and a half to you. I miss you. Despite Playtime's proclamation of Ludwig's innocence, many believe his reclusive and mysterious nature displayed over the previous decades lend suspicion to this claim. When questioned, Ludwig's neighbors indicated that he would often return to his home in strange hours of the night and depart again before sunrise. Some believed he was sick. Others that don't move, don't move an inch. Playtime Co., it seems, Intends to keep Elliot's name within its brand regardless. What is sure to be a long legal battle will follow. There he is. 
out or something? Being fun, why was it done? Gonna take. Greetings, employees, and welcome to your first day here in Playtime. We're certain that in the days to come, you'll find your new family here every bit as loving and supportive as your own. Feel free to wander the halls sit in the mess for lunch, or watch our children play and learn to their little heart's content. Join the innovationists where the bounds of science are continuously pushed, or join the counselors of Playcare whose diligence and care for our children will help shape a brighter future. Just you see. Now, every one of you has your part in that future, so should you come back tomorrow feeling unhappy for where you are, or what you've done, Worry not, for your supervisor is here and happy to listen. And, should you come back years later, your conscience finally getting the better of you, what? may you descend into the dark and the dust, finding all that awaits you are incomprehensible horrors, each hungry for your return, each eager that they might find you. Perhaps they'd smile at you from a shadow, their smiling mouths full of teeth and meat and plastic, watching and waiting patiently Creepy for their turn at a warm welcome. Or perhaps they won't allow you such time to figure your place in the world you'd left, a world that's theirs now. This is getting dark. Welcome home. What the? Holy shit. Murder me to the TV. Oh, I guess it was a dream after all.
Good old neck cap. All right, what does this thing say? A hug a day keeps the monsters away. Two hugs a day is better in every way. Hugging forever. Hugs are non-stop. 
I'm gonna hug you until you pop. A hug a day keeps the monsters away. Huggy Wuggy? No, no! Let go! They didn't do anything wrong! Poppy? We're actually here to help. <sighs> Poppy this place that. makes her tense. I'm glad that Ollie could help you get this far. He's the reason we found you at all. Or is that Kissy Missy? Oh, it's Kissy Missy. Never mind. Looks like the train crash hurt us both. Yeah, it did. You've been through so much. You deserve an explanation. Yes, Come on. yes I do. Hey, you'll be okay. We'll be okay. Your enemy, but I can't just let you leave. What's happening down here is bigger than all of us, and I need you so we can get revenge on those monsters who've tortured you, who've tortured us. They didn't act alone, they're disciples of the original, the prototype. Do the honors. Yep. 
Okay, now what? Go back down? Prototype knows we're coming by now. If you try to escape, he'll kill you before you ever reach that front door. He's the reason I was trapped in that god-awful case for so long. You have no idea of the things he's done. Let me help you kill him. Let me help you save everyone. We've all seen you. How capable you are. You killed Huggy. You killed Mommy. You freed me. You are perfect for this. Catnip okay. is coming. He's the final obstacle the prototype has placed against us. We can't stay here. Keep yourself safe. Ollie will call you. Okay. I guess you're hiding upstairs. Hey, 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 it's me again. It seems like Poppy explained everything now, and she turned on the dome's backup power. Now the plan from here is pretty simple. We need to restore power to the gas production zone. First, go back to the home sweet home building you were just in. You should be able to find a big power cord somewhere around the porch. Grab it and plug it in underneath the statue. Okay. By the porch, huh? Got the key. So I need to get the school, the playhouse, the offices, and possibly the toy store. Well, actually, I think I just need those three. Everything else is sealed. Okay, let's go to the school. I 
computers. Alright, need two batteries. Alright, there's one. How do I get to that one? Get it from in there. Okay. Hello. I guess that was Miss Delight. Wait, I recognize you. Yes. I remember you, you used to work here. How are you alive? Hmm? Barb? Oh. Barb says you're looking for your co-workers. Catnap wouldn't like that you're here. You should leave. For your own safety. Well, I'm trying to. Not a good listener, are you? You're a lot like the other humans in that way. I wonder if your screams will sound like theirs too. <laughs> I look forward to finding out. Look, lady, I'm just trying to start the generating lead. How did it open that this time? Come on.
slug. Subjects. Press my button to hear some facts on anatomy. Did you know that there are 60,000 miles of blood vessels in the human body? For comparison, the Earth around the equator is almost 25,000 miles. The smallest bone in your body is the states in your ear. Still, damage it, and you risk losing your hearing. Want to learn more about human organs? Pay close attention in class. Hello, students. Find my sisters and I to learn. <laughs> it's like you can't get me <clears throat> dead.
So fuck you, die bitch. Thank you. Reaching? Nothing, nothing. Let's just get this shipment dropped and go. Hello, my name is Elliot Ludwig. Would you look around? I take it you're not a fan of this place, are you? Nope. Never liked the feel of it. I mean, don't you think these kids deserve some real sunlight instead of floodlights and painted skies? Hell, we're not even allowed to talk to these kids. Isn't that... <clears throat> <sighs> Sorry, Stu. Sorry? <laughs> that doesn't sound like the rich I know. Well, trying to stop being so pissed off all the time. My wife says I'm a lovely man, but I gotta control my temper. So, I'm doing it for her. <laughs> uh, you're just different, Rich. Honest to a fault. But uh, I always liked that about you. Yeah? <laughs> well, you're one of the few. Uh, you know, Richie, with my retirement coming up, uh, they've been pushing hard for me to choose my replacement. I'm thinking about giving the role to you. But, uh, really? Really? Nothing official yet. But I think there's a decent guy beneath all that graph. And honestly, 
hard working man. You prove me right? I say your chances are pretty good. Wow, I, uh, geez, I don't know what to say. I, I'm just glad to see not everyone in this place has it out for me. Not everybody, Rich. Not everybody. <laughs> Hi, I'm Bobby Bear Hug. Want to know how much I love you? I love you to the moon and back. Wait, angry cat. Leave me alone. Oh shit, just like... What the fuck, man? you Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, let's go that way. Oh shit. Oh, the player scare him. I should do that earlier. Back off, buddy. How the hell do I get out of here now? I even go. I'm going in circles.
to be doing? Prison cells? You, you're a Papi's angel. Come to save us. What happened to you? Nothing left to save. Not here. Or catnaps home, angel. They're home. A million pairs of eyes are on you now. Watching. Waiting. Hungry. They want nothing more than to crawl beneath your skin and eat away at you bit by little bit. Fill what feels empty inside themselves. That thing, Catnap, the prototype is his god, and this is what he does to heretics. These little toys follow Catnap to avoid that very fate, and in return, that <clears throat> we try to fight it. The prototype's control. I am the last of the smiling critters. Listen to me. You need to get out of this place. You need to live. You and Poppy could fix this. End this madness. The torment. Oh no. Oh no. Leave me. Please.
dog day says, fetch! Go, go, as far as you can! Why are you just standing there? You can't be here. You can't stay. It's Ollie. Hey, are you all right? No. No ouchies or lost body parts? <sighs> nope.
men. Come on in. Please, have a seat. How was your ride down? It was, uh, nothing like we were expecting. Uh, Mr. Ludwig's speech was... Well, it just confirms for us that you're the orphanage we want to go through. It's a truly magical place. I felt right at home from the second I entered. You open that door the first time and you just know. You're never going to leave. Kind of like finding a home as a child and always thinking of it when you want to feel comforted. <clears throat> I understand you want to give Jeremy that home. Yes, and we would like to adopt. Ah, amazing! You'll be perfect for... Oh. What? Well, it appears there's been some complications. Complications? What kind of complications? I... I don't know. Um, the form says... testing. <laughs> what does that mean? Tell us, what does that mean? Miss Graper, we deserve a better explanation than that. Don't you think? You're in charge of all this! How could you not know? And why are we only finding out about this now? I... I don't. I'm sorry. Hi! I'm Crafty Corn. Can you help me with my painting? Pass me the blue, please. Thanks! Now, can you give me some red? More red, please! Out? But we can't be out. You're hiding more red from me. I know you are. Give it here! Alright, I got one battery now. Now I'm just set to find the other one. Come on, get over here.
Your type has saved us all. this
Kijk dan, gee. Log code 24459. In relation, experiment 1006. The prototype. Stubborn as he is, and always silent with each passing session, I'm still uncovering fresh data nonetheless. Today's discovery... <laughs> Ready to talk now, are you? I possess a question. Go ahead. Do you feel anything? <sighs> this question referred to what exactly? You stick us, beat us, tear our flesh. Do you feel it? There's a secret inside you, 1006. Valuable beyond all measure. I cut and prod and burn at it. And I get closer with each session. So speak. Or don't. Fight! Or give in. Regardless, I learn something new about you every day. <laughs> it excites me. Thank you. You thank me? Absolutely. I learned something new about you every day.
Oh shit, it can mimic voices.
got him! <laughs> she get motherfucker. And he's dead. This is gonna be used for parts now. I lost my green hand. Back down. Right, let's put this thing back in. Deserve to have the truth. You came back because of your co workers. You want to know what oh, happened and why. This. This is your answer. We called it the Hour of Joy.
remember hearing every moment of it. It went on so long, so agonizingly long. They tried to hide, to run, anything to stay alive. I remember their cries. What's going on? Why is this happening? What are those things? Senseless slaughter, that's all it really was. They killed everyone. The guilty, the innocent, didn't matter. All that death didn't fix anything. And then, once it was all over, they dragged those corpses down below where they'd never be found. And they ate the bodies to stay alive. Prototype has to die. For this. For everything. Soon as we reach the bottom, we'll send the lift back up. Just hold tight, okay? After you! Okay. Once we hit the ground, we need to be cautious. There's something... Chapter 3. That was a fun game. But it was a long one. Wish it could have been shorter. And less puzzles.
All right, everybody. Thanks for watching.